Hi friends and my dear children. Today's session we are going to discuss multi-correct and comprehensive type model questions. So in this video, first we will go through multi-correct answer model questions. Which of the following numbers is not complete cubes? So they have given four options. Among this, at least two, two correct answers will be there. At least two correct answers will be there. So let us check. So what is the correct answer? Which of the following number is not a complete cube? So observe the statement. So here, which of the following option is not a perfect cube? So if you observe option number one, so 64 is nothing but a 4 cube. So this is a perfect cube. So this is not going to be our answer. Okay. Then, so coming to 216. So 216. So this is a nothing but a 6 cube. 6 cube. Okay. Then coming to 243. So 1 to 15 our square values so, so there is a no 243 okay so this is going to be our correct answer and so one more thing 256 also not going to be our perfect cube okay then how we can decide these two are uh, uh, correct answers so that is uh, so if you Find the LCM of 243. If you can divide with 3, so 3 8s are and 3 1s are. So again, you can divide with 3. So 3 27s are. Again, you can divide with the 3 9s are. So 3 3s are. So if you write here 3 power 3 and 3 power 2. So if a number wants to be a perfect cube that should be repeat so any factor should repeat three times so here three times three repeated so but here only two times so one more three we need to this should be perfect cube so this is one of the correct answer then coming to 256 so if you divide so 256 with 8. So 8 3s are 24. 1 and 6, 8 2s are. So now again you can divide with uh, so 8. So 8 4s uh, are 32. So here 8 2 times repeated and uh, so only 4 is there. So if the remaining number so is 8, uh, then it is going to be our answer. So here option number 3 and option number 4 are the not perfect cubes. 4 are the not perfect cubes. So then let us go for next question. Now we will discuss second multi-correct answer type question. Which of the following number are cubes at rational numbers? So here we should find cubes cubes at uh, rational numbers. So you know that. So the numbers which are in the form of uh, P by Q, where P comma Q are uh, real numbers and uh, the numbers which are uh, terminating are also rational numbers. So if you check uh, 27 by 64, 27 by 64, here 3 cube so 3 cube means 27 and 4 cube means 64 so this is a this is a perfect cube number at rational okay here if you observe second option so 5 cube means 125 so where 128 is not a perfect cube so this is a not a perfect cube okay then if you observe 
ऑप्शन नंबर थ्री सो दिस इज नथिंग बट जीरो पॉइंट वन वन जीरो पॉइंट वन वन क्यूब सो दिस इज गोइंग टू बी जीरो पॉइंट जीरो जीरो वन थ्री थ्री वन सो यू नो दैट सी लेवन क्यूब इज वन थ्री थ्री वन हियर जीरो पॉइंट लेवन क्यूब इज नथिंग बट जीरो पॉइंट जीरो जीरो वन क्यूब सो दिस इज ऑल्सो परफेक्ट क्यूब सो दे कमिंग टू जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फोर सो दिस इज नथिंग बट जीरो पॉइंट टू क्यूब सो टू क्यूब सो इफ यू टेक जीरो पॉइंट टू सो जीरो पॉइंट टू इंटू जीरो पॉइंट टू सो यू विल गेट जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फोर सो दिस इज नॉट क्यूब वैल्यू सो दिस इज ओनली जीरो पॉइंट टू टू होल स्क्वेर वैल्यू सो दट इज वाई सो दिस इज ऑल्सो नॉट ए परफेक्ट क्यूब सो कमिंग टू अवर करेक्ट ऑप्शन ऑप्शन नंबर वन एंड ऑप्शन नंबर थ्री आर द वन एंड थ्री आर द करेक्ट आंसर सो कमिंग टू मल्टी करेक्ट आंसर टाइप सो द नंबर्स विच आर हैविंग टू आर मोर करेक्ट आंसर नथिंग बट मल्टी करेक्ट आंसर देन लेट अस गो फॉर कॉम्प्रेहेंसिव टाइप राइट नाउ लेट अस डिस्कस कॉम्प्रेहेंशन टाइप सो हियर इन द कॉम्प्रेहेंशन टाइप सो दे विल गिव वन स्टेटमेंट based on this statement so we should answer the question here only one correct answer will be there see what is the statement to find the smallest number by which a number must be multiplied or otherwise divided so that the product or quotient is a perfect cube so that means if you multiply a number so then that should be perfect cube so if you divide with a number then that should be a perfect cube so let us go for the question number 23 the smallest number by which 1323 that means 1323 should be multiplied so that the product is a perfect cube is so with what number if you multiply 1 3 2 3 that should be perfect cube so if i divide the given number with 3 so 3 4 12 again 3 4 12 3 1 3 so the remainder is 441 so again you can divide with 3 3 4 3 1 so 3 4 are 12 and 3 7 are 21 so again remainder is 147 so if you divide again with 3 so 3 4 are 12 2 7 remaining is there 3 9 are 27 so here it is 49 the remainder so 7 7 are 49 so if you observe this product so 3 power 3 power 3 and 7 power 2 so if you have one more 7 if you have one more 7 so that is going to be a perfect cube so we need 7 so then only it is going to be perfect cube so coming to option number 1 6 so this is a not a correct answer then 1 also not a correct answer then 4 not a correct answer then what is our correct answer if you multiply with 7 then it is going to be perfect cube value then let us go for question number 20 question number 24 the smallest number by which 2916 should be divided so that the quotient is a perfect number then what we should do so we should divide the given number we should divide the given number 2916 so 2916 so if you divide with 4 you will get quotient 729 so if you divide with 9 so you will get 81 so if you divide with 9 again 9 nines are here what are the factors so 9 cube and additional 
नाइन इज देर सो इफ यू डिवाइड टू नाइन वन सिक्स विथ दिस फोर देन यू आर गोइंग टू गेट सो सेवन हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी नाइन सो दिस इज परफेक्ट क्यूब वैल्यू सो वाट इज द ऑप्शन ऑप्शन नंबर टू इज द करेक्ट आंसर देन लेट एस गो फॉर क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी लेट एस डिस्कस क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी फाइव द स्मॉलेस्ट नंबर बाई विच वन थ्री सेवन फाइव शुड बी डिवाइडेड सो दट द क्वेश्चन इज ए परफेक्ट क्यूब इज सो द गिवेन नंबर इज वन थ्री सेवन फाइव सो इफ यू डिवाइड दिस नंबर विथ फाइव सो वाट यू विल गेट रिमाइंडर टू सेवेंटी फाइव फाइव टू जार फाइव सेवन जार एंड फाइव फाइव जार सो अगेन टू सेवेंटी फाइव इफ यू डिवाइड विथ फाइव सो फाइव फाइव जार ट्वेंटी फाइव एंड अगेन फाइव फाइव जार ट्वेंटी फाइव देन फाइव लेवन जार सो इफ यू राइट फैक्टर्स ऑफ वन थ्री सेवन फाइव सो दट इज फाइव क्यूब एंड लेवन फाइव क्यूब एंड लेवन हियर फाइव थ्री टाइम्स देर एंड लेवन सो दिस लेवन इफ यू डिवाइड वन थ्री सेवन फाइव बाई लेवन द रिमेनिंग द रिमेनिंग quotient is going to be a perfect cube then coming to our option is option number 1 11 if you divide 1375 with 11 so the remaining number is going to be a perfect cube so this is the comprehension model questions and so we have completed successfully chapter 1 we have completed successfully chapter 1 so from the next video onwards i am going to start chapter number 2 triangle of 6th standard iit foundation course so until watch all my previous videos and so write a notes for your future reference until keep watching and thank you thank you very much children